time to see what's in the story box. Mermaids! Can't wait! <laughs> hey, swim fans! Hope you're ready to get your fins wet. Are you so hyped for the 60th annual Aquathon? You know it, Daisy. I mean, just smell that ocean. It's good to be back. Fun fact, everyone. Ken actually won this race twice when he was a champion swimmer. Ken, you've been there. Tell us what's going through the competitors' minds right now. You know, Daisy, all of the training and hard work has brought them to this moment for the opportunity to win the Golden Shell Trophy. I remember the first time I got to hoist that magnificent trophy. Ah, those were the days. At the starting line, we've got Mimi the Mermaid. Yeah! Derek the Dolphin. And the reigning champion, Rubber Ducky. We have a great crowd here today, including the Aquathon's greatest champion of all time, Amelia Fisk. Her daughter Mimi is one of the competitors. Good luck, Mimi. May the best swimmer win. Thanks, Derek. I'm so nervous. Don't be nervous. Just do your best. I just hope I can make my mom proud. Dream on, mermaid. That trophy is mine. Don't listen to him, Mimi. He may have won a few times, but he doesn't know what it means to be a real champion. On your marks, get set. Swim! The key to the marshmallow challenge is swimming between each one without touching any of them. If you touch one, you have to start over. Ouch! It's not as easy as it looks. I remember my first attempt at this challenge. It was a doozy. Excuse me, please. Try to get through. Oh no! Looks like you have to start over. Rough start for Mimi the mermaid with that starfish. But she's catching back up, right Ken? Ken, why are you putting on swim goggles? Um, no reason. It's easy to get dizzy during the cyclone challenge. You have to swim around the pole 100 times. I'm woozy just watching them. 62, 63, 98, 99, 100! Well, that's not very sportsmanlike. It looks like Rubber Ducky has knocked over Mimi's pole. Accident or sabotage? There's no way to tell. I suppose I could always investigate, Ken? Okay, okay. Everyone okay? Yes. Yay! Let's go, let's go, let's go! That pole falling wasn't an accident, and neither was the starfish. I told you, I'm here to win. Winning by cheating is not a real victory, Ducky. Tell that to my trophies. Swimmers are approaching the fans' favorite obstacle, Coral Springs. Perfect splash. Rubber Ducky is the one to beat. Reminds me of my final swim in Aquathon 39. But here comes Mimi. Like mother, like daughter. Derek the dolphin just squeaks by. Oh no! Turtle hits the pole! If only I could show him how it's done. Ken, I know you miss swimming in the Aquathon. I miss it so much! But we have to let others have their shot at the spotlight. I know, it's just winning the Aquathon made me feel like a hero. You don't stop being a hero when the competition ends. <sighs> You're right, Daisy. Now, let's see who's in the lead. We're in the final stretch of the Aquathon. The water sprint. The swimmers must go as fast as they possibly can to reach the finish line. I told you, Mimi. Victory is... Ducky, look out! 
Talk about a collision course. We've got a lifeguard in the water. Help me. I ate less than 30 minutes ago. I'm cramping. Well, what are you waiting for, champ? Yes, my moment has come. Ducky, Ducky, are you okay? What? Ducky's hurt. We need to help Ducky. Mimi, you could have won. You could have had the trophy all to yourself. Why did you stop for me? Some things are more important than winning, Ducky. Well done, you guys. Mimi, I'm so proud of you. You acted like a real champion today. Thanks, Mom. Mimi, I just wanted to say, I'm sorry the competition got the best of me. Apology accepted. By the way, Miss Fisk, I'm a huge fan. Can I get an autograph? And that's the story of how two rivals became fast friends. What's next for you two? We're going to be training partners, but first we're off to get... Seaweed smoothies! Uh, sounds delicious. What stories will you tell? <laughs>